This Friday at noon, we have a special guest we'd like you to meet. Once in a while, a TV star drops by, and today Michael Palance is here. Maybe you know him as Dr. Dan Wolick on ABC's One Life to Live, but he's a Western North Carolinian, at least for the day, and welcome. <laughs> Thank you for joining Thank us. Thank you. I know a lot of people would like to hear your story because it's kind of mm -hmm. remarkable. You're just 19, mm -hmm. and you've been working for, what, uh, the better part of a year? Uh, well, I've been working professionally for about uh, close to two years now, uh, pretty much steadily, luckily. Uh, about four years ago, when I was 15, my mom's friend, he was, uh, her son was doing modeling and things like that, and my mom said, would you like to try modeling? And I said, sure, you know, I was 15. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Uh, so I got pictures taken, and I was recommended to see someone and that person was a theatrical agent, not a modeling agent. Mm -hmm. And she said to me, well, I can recommend people to you for modeling, but if you'd like to try acting, maybe we can work something out. So I thought about it, and I said, yeah, acting seems a little harder than modeling. So uh, I tried it out, and she sent me out on some auditions. And on Saturdays and after school and stuff, I would go study in the city. Mm -hmm. And uh, it worked out. <laughs> sure did. Now this is what, about an eight month stint or so on One Life to Live so far, uh, the better part of a year? It's been about, how many months? It's been about seven months. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And you are the son of an ongoing character. Gosh, mm -hmm. this guy's been on the soap for years and years. Mm -hmm. What are they doing with your character right now? Well, they had me going after my dad's girl for a little while. <laughs> it was so juicy. It was. And then um, it sort of leaned off of it. And I've been helping Brenda find her baby. And um, now I'm starting to spend a little bit more time with Kelly, bartender at Max's. You're kind of a nice guy, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, I'm a nice guy. Nice guy. Think we could dish up a little dirt for you anytime hey, I, in the near future? I wouldn't mind getting a little shady. It wouldn't hurt too much. Well, for everybody who'd like to see Michael, of course, while he's here, he'll be a guest at the Ingalls Food Booth, and that's uh, the one we're operating, the WLOS Food Booth at the fair. And you can see him tonight at 6 o'clock, and uh, he'll sign an autograph for you, maybe tell you a little bit more about his story. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you.